Hi y'all, today we're going to take a look at types boosting and types reducing on the Daisy Boosters website. I apologize for the voice, I had a bad flu last week and I'm just getting over it. Uh, let's go ahead and start with types boosting. Uh, we can uh, grab this file and drop it in a couple different ways. We can drag it from here and put it down here or you can click there and open it that way. Now it's in there and you can click next. And then that's going to say, hey, how many times do you want to multiply whatever you're going to multiply loot wise? Let's say we're going to do it five times. We're picking the Cherneris map. Uh, if you want to take a look at all the different targets that you can select, uh, here's all the basically all the all the loot. Basically, you can copy if all that and top throw it into a document if you wanted to for whatever reason. But, uh, so we're doing five times Cherneris map, click next. And here, this is what we're going to do. We're going to target only uh, certain stuff. So let's uh, target weapons, loose ammo, magazines, and boxed ammo. And then click next. And then here, since we selected targets, we can't exclude in this section. You can, we can redo the file afterwards, but we're going to keep moving on towards uh, reducing after this. Uh, so from here we can click next and then submit and then here it is you click download and we'll drop it in downloads and open it and so this here is the vanilla type so let's take a look at a AK 101 there it is right there uh, so it's on vanilla types you can see two nominal one minimum but over here, we've got 10 nominal and 5 minimum. So it went 5 times how many it was. Uh, and you can see the same thing down in ammo. So we've got uh, buckshot. We've got 100 nominal and 75 minimum. But in the vanilla file, we can see we had 20 and 15 minimum. So that's multiplied by 5. Perfect. All right, so to move on to the next step, we're going to need to save as. We're going to want to save it as a types file. So let me go ahead and get back over here. So this is, uh, that one's been boosted. So we'll, it's a Turner's map. We're just going to rename it types. So we're just overwrite that old file. And now we can go ahead and close this. And we're going to move over here two types reducer all right so we're gonna want to go here and this is where we dropped it so we're gonna want to take that file drop it in there click next so now we're gonna reduce it so let's go ahead and reduce by oh let's say 80% it's gonna say hey hey some items may reduce your ratio of one to one that's we could fix that that's not a problem Still Turner's map. Click next. Uh, this time we're going to go ahead and click through the targets. We're going to go to the exclusions. So this time we're going to exclude the magazines, the boxed ammo, the loose ammo, and the firearms because that's what we boosted last time. So we don't, we don't want to reduce them. We just boosted those suckers. We can click next and submit. And then here it's going to be. And go ahead and open that up and now we've got a new reduced file all right so we can see that it's reduced because we've got over here we'll go to the top of the file again we've got an ACOG optic is 10 nominal six minimum but over here we've got two nominal one minimum and you can see that down here the AK 101 has still been boosted five times that hasn't changed since we excluded that from the last one um, but for the next step, we're going to have to rename this again. So we'll save as, we'll get back over here where we were, DZP types. Now this, this one's been reduced. So we'll go ahead and overwrite this old file here, rename this to types, say yes. We can close that now because what we're going to do next here is why don't we go ahead and organize it. Some other stuff you can do here is uh, tier boost so we could just boost tier three and four or just one and two whatever 
and just boost certain loot in those areas. And you can do the same thing, pick exclusions and targets. Uh, and there's also a lifetime reducer because some of the lifetimes are kind of ridiculous. So you can reduce the full lifetimes by half. We'll go over that some other time. For now, we're going to go ahead and go to Organizer. We're going to go back to, we were at, the last thing we did was reduce. So we'll go ahead and put that file that we've been working on twice already. And we'll drop it in here. And then say, hey, process and organize. We'll go ahead and put that in downloads and open it. And we can see that everything is all sorted. You can uh, take a look uh, if you want to see where all the ghillies were. You could just drop control F, drop your all the way down there. And you can see there's all the ghillies. So you can uh, change those however you want. But you know where everything is at because everything is all nice and sorted. Some of the other tools on the website, we've got an NPC generator, loadout generator, gameplay generator, messages generator. We've got all the different converters. We've gone over a couple of these. We've, we'll go over the other ones later. We've got a global configurator. We've got a map group pause to event spawn generator. We've got a weather manager. We've got a day night calculator. We've got the economy editor, JSON validator, XML validator. So, and we're adding things all the time. So this is going to be your one stop shopping here. Daisy boosters were accessed without barriers means free and always will be. Thanks for watching.